What's going on everybody? My name is Leezy the Gifted. If you don't already know me, I'm a rapper and a music producer. I've been doing music for over nine years. At first, I only was writing lyrics as a rapper for the first seven years, and for the last two, two and a half years, I've been fully producing my own music, making my own beats, writing lyrics, recording vocals, mixing and mastering. So, today's video is gonna be a little bit different, but before I tell you about the video, what I want you to do is hit that subscribe button, smash that bell notification so you can always get notified every time I put out a new video. Now, today's video, we're gonna talk about something a little bit different. We're gonna talk about something mindset related. I've been diving into a lot of different Facebook groups, trying to interact with musicians, producers, songwriters, and I asked, I posed a question in a bunch of the groups, and the question was, what's your biggest challenge with your music career? Obviously, I got tons of different responses, but one response that I heard, that I kind of have heard multiple times, confidence. That's a tough one, and it's funny because I posted a TikTok a while ago and I was saying how you have to earn confidence. What did I even say? Something like you have to earn confidence and somebody had comment commented back on that video where I was talking about earning confidence. Somebody had commented, oh, easy for you to say, for you confident people. But I realized I haven't always been confident. And I come off super confident, I am confident. But you gotta understand, I I had I wasn't always like this. I used to be not confident. I'm still really have my insecurities and things that I want to get better at, but I've worked at feeling the way I feel about myself. The before you can and like a lot of you musicians and producers and rappers and all that, you guys really wanna build a fan base right or a following or a cult like following well how can to do that you need to get people to believe in you well how are you going to do that if you don't believe in yourself like obviously you're going to always have that level of humility of you can always do better but you can't build a cult like following so before all you can worry about facebook ads and influencer marketing and spotify playlist curation why aren't you putting out more music why aren't you putting out more material why aren't you putting out more content? Why aren't you putting out more YouTube videos and podcasts and blogs? Like, Why aren't you doing more? You keep wanting all these people to put you on, but the fact is you aren't even doing enough to earn the exposure. So stop asking for all these different things and trying to figure out how to get yourself out there. You, there's nothing to figure out. Put yourself out there more. And you might think... and. and Really the reason, I think the reason a lot of people don't put themselves out there is lack of confidence. You think, well I don't know what you exactly think, you watching might have different thoughts than the other people watching, but what I've noticed is some people don't put stuff out because they think people don't wanna hear from them and that's just not true. It's just not true. I used to think the same thing, I had imposter syndrome. Why would people wanna listen to me? Why do people wanna hear my music? My music's not good. But you know what, I kept working at it. I kept trying to put more effort into my craft. When I decided that I wanted to produce music, before I decided to produce music, I said I will never produce music, that's not my job, I'm a rapper, I'm an artist, that's it. And when I st and what I really realized though was the reason I didn't produce music was because in my head I thought that's way too hard for me, I can't do it. That comes from confidence and a lack of it. And you know what, I let that shit go. And I said, dude, I gotta let that go, cause I need to produce music out of survival. So if you really need something, like if you really want exposure, if you really want this, that, and the third, but you're not confident in yourself enough to actually go out there and get it, dude, you gotta fix that. You gotta fix that confidence. Because the only reason you're not putting out more music is because you're not confident enough. That's the only reason. Now, I obviously have different strategies for how to put out music. I more, think that you should put out singles rather than albums. But to be honest with you, if you put out albums, fine. At least you're putting some music out there. That's great. That's better than not putting music out. But I also think you need to be putting out way more content than just music. That's a whole nother video that I've actually already done. But but that's another, that's another topic. How do you earn the confidence now? Let's talk about that. So. Like I said, by the way, not how do you get confidence. You don't get confidence. Nobody's gonna give you confidence. I'm not gonna sit here and hand you confidence. Here's your confidence. 
The confidence is inside of you. You have it. You just need to pull it out. You have to earn it, okay? Here's how you do that. You do things that are difficult. The one thing I would say to start with, do something exercise related. Do something exercise related. Because physical fitness is super crucial. If you feel physically fit, you're gonna feel much more mentally fit, aka mentally healthy, and your emotions are gonna be way more in check. Trust me because I'm in good shape. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna brag. I worked really hard to be in good shape. I just actually went through this thing called 75 hard, which if you don't know about it, you should go check it out. Just Google 75 hard or go on YouTube. But I just completed 75 hard and I lost 26 pounds. Dude, I feel freaking amazing. I look way better than I used to. Do you know how hard 75 hard was? A diet, reading, gallon of water, and exercising twice a day. It's freaking hard. But it made me more confident than I've ever been in my life. And am I sitting here giving you the answer on how to make a million bucks or how to get a million streams or how to get 10,000 followers on Instagram? No, I'm not. I don't, I'm not telling you all that right now. You need the confidence first. Plus, I don't even know how to make a million bucks because I don't have a million bucks or a million followers. I'm not sitting here trying to lie to you and sell you information where I don't know the answer. I'm telling you what I do know, confidence, because I'm super freaking confident. I don't have a problem putting out two songs a month, a YouTube video every week, and a podcast every week, and you probably have that problem. If you don't have that problem, you don't need this video. But if you're watching this video and you're this deep into it, chances are you need to work on your confidence. So I would start with something physical related. Take some kind of physical exercise, running, biking, walking, I, actually not walking, go a little harder than walking, a little bit harder. Maybe you'll do a certain amount of push-ups or crunches or squats every day. Make a little bit of a workout plan. You don't need a gym membership. We can't go to the gym right now because of the freaking coronavirus. You don't need a gym membership. Go in your bathroom, go in your living room, go in your bedroom, go in your backyard, go on your balcony, go out in the middle of the street. You can go in the middle of the street, ain't no cars driving by. Do 100 squats, 100 push-ups, 100 sit-ups. You're not gonna wanna do it. Freaking do it anyway. Grab a book. I'm trying to see if I have any books near me. Dude, grab a freaking book and read 10 pages every single day. Grab a book. You're not gonna wanna do it at first, but guess what? You're gonna get hella information. I could do a whole nother video on reading. Comment below if you want recommendations for which books you should read. I don't know every single book in the whole wide world, but I got a lot of great books I can suggest to you. Comment below if you wanna know that, all right? Go read a book every day. Drink a gallon of water. This is actually a half gallon of water. By the way, check this uh, sticker out. This is actually a half gallon of water, so I drink two of these a day. Um, drink a gallon of water. Just put something on yourself that's gonna be difficult. Say, I'm gonna wake up at 6 a.m. every day, and I'm gonna start my day going strong every day. Like, guys, do something that's going to be hard. And by the way, you cannot do it for one day, or two, or three, or four, or even, honestly, 30 days. It's not enough. You have to do it longer than that. I did mine for 75 days, and it worked. I actually ended up doing it longer. But the point of this, how do you build confidence? You do things that are difficult, and I know that might sound obvious to some. And if you do, by the way, if you do, cool, you don't need this video, but I get, if you're watching this deep, we're at eight and a half minutes, you need to work on your confidence, and that's good. We all need something to work on. I still need to work on my confidence too, but I'm a lot, I'm a lot further along in my confidence journey than a lot of other people. So I wanted to come out here and make this video to try and help some people get more confident. That's what you can do. Don't rely on other people because nobody else is gonna give you confidence. Do not think about what other people think about you because that doesn't matter. And if you do that, you're never gonna be confident. Don't compare yourself to other people and other musicians because it doesn't matter. Everybody's on their own journey. You're on your own journey. So stop thinking about what everybody else is doing. Stop looking at how many followers this guy or this girl has or how big this girl's butt is or how dope that dude's six pack is. Stop looking at the cars that guy's driving. Stop looking at the, it, dude, that, that isn't going to make you a confident person. That's gonna make you less confident, okay? So stop diving into that shit. So hey, thank you so much for watching. If you've gotten this far, my name's Lazy the Gifted. Subscribe below smash that bell notification smash that like button i appreciate all the engagement and support love you guys appreciate you guys and i will see you next week peace